in the ships. Baron Corbin is raring for a fight. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. The lone wolf mentality is back. No one's safe. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Kansas City. Weighing in at 285 pounds. Baron Corbin. A perfect hybrid athlete. Size, speed, strength, and skill. Baron Corbin, one of the most dominant forces to attack a WWE ring in recent memory. Ready to take what's his. Baron Corbin is ready to go. And believe me, Corbin has zero concern about the wreckage and collateral damage. Apollo is here, and he is determined. And his opponent from Benway State, Nigeria, weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews! Made a return to NXT, joined the main event scene there, and is doing the best work of his career. Always had the athleticism, but now he has a drive like never before. I think we're going to see Cruz hit even greater heights than before. We know he has the power, the speed, the skills. Now Apollo needs to tie it all together to reach that next level. And there's definitely a new spark in Baron Corbin these days. It seems he's rekindled something that might have flickered out some time ago. He's just so much more focused now. And we all know that a focused Corbin is a dangerous Corbin. But Apollo Crews is as focused as he's ever been. And he's going to put up quite the fight. And into the count. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? A little closer to getting the pinfall there, but this is still anybody's fight. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Corbin is feeding off the WWE Universe. Oh my goodness, wow. Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. Oof, devastating knee to the neck. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Ripped from the outside in. Choke slam! Cruz resolve might be wavering here. He could pin his opponent right here. He's able to kick out before two. Those one counts getting harder and harder to kick out of. now from Corbin. Yeah, Apollo needs to reassess his strategy. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. 
Corey, we both agree that Corbin is not an individual whom you want to exchange fisticuffs with. But what does an opponent do to prevent the matchup turning into something resembling a boxing match? How many competitors have won both the Golden Gloves and the King of the Ring? I'll tell you, none. Don't throw hands with Corbin. You'll get dropped. The only way is to hope against all hope that you might be able to outgrapple Corbin, which also isn't likely. A powerbomb like that will leave you with bruises and remind you of this moment for days. He's looking a little weary now. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Corbin gets stymied. Apollo is going to look to press on the advantage. Yeah, but he needs to maintain some offense to fully get back in this one. Oh, my Lord! Corbin fights back. Look at this. He's got something coming. Oh, oh, what a Samoan drop. Apollo looking to take to the sky. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. German fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just going to step aside now. Hey, wait for me. Sit through that. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Position. Here it comes. Big oh. splash in the corner. That was more splatter than splash. Corbin with a deep six. Corbin with the emphatic, aggressive statement right there. And the sick pleasure out of it to boot. No way. Astounding power. The end of days. And Apollo's laid out. That's got to be it. Two. An emphatic victory. Here is your winner, Baron Corbin! Baron Corbin leaving tonight with the victory. I know Corbin wanted this bad. He wanted to make a statement. Message received. Don't mess with Baron Corbin.